Nickerson giving you the buzz on local news and events. Today I'm going to feature two of our smaller local parks as part of our Where's Laura series. So let's do that with a giant double oversized episode. Let's take a look at the first park while I fill you in on the buzz. So this park is small but mighty. Think you know where I am? Tweet at us at Buzz Calabasas, hashtag Where's Laura, and you might win a prize. The elections are coming. The elections are coming. So make sure you participate by heading over to the candidate forum. The City of Calabasas, in partnership with the League of Women Voters of Los Angeles, will host the 2015 City of Calabasas City Council Candidate Forum on September 24th from 7 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. at Founders Hall in the Calabasas Library. The event is free and open to the public. Questions should be concise and relevant to the community and municipal government. Not all questions will be used and some may be modified to fit the format of the Candidate Forum. Questions can be submitted to cityofcalabasas.com slash forumquestions.html. So come and make sure you get involved in our city government. The elections are coming. The elections are coming. Hey, savvy seniors. Are you looking for some great entertainment right here in Calabasas? Check out singer Bonnie Bowden. Bonnie Bowden will be performing her one-woman show on Friday, September 18th at Juan Batista De Anza Park starting at 6 p.m. Bring your own blankets, chairs, and picnic dinner and enjoy her rendition of Broadway hits, movies, and the Great American Songbook. Great entertainment and no driving on the freeway. Can't get better than that. <laughs> now it's time for our emergency preparedness tip of the week. In continuing to create your fire escape plan, practice getting out of your house in the dark or with your eyes closed. Find this tip and links to more at the homepage of the City of Calabasas website. This second park is just as small and equally impressive. Doesn't have a baseball diamond though. Although I know where you can have a little baseball themed fun, the Take Me Out to the Ball Game Day. The Cabrillo Music Theater is launching their upcoming production of Damn Yankees and the Replay It campaign at Take Me Out to the Ball Game, a day of music, baseball, and heart. The event features sports activities, entertainment, an exhibition softball game with Conejo Valley Little League, sports stars, and great food. Take Me Out takes place on Saturday, September 19th from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. at Fiore Playfields, located at Avenida de los Arboles and the 23 Freeway in Thousand Oaks. Musicals and sports combined with free family fun? <laughs> Doesn't get any better than that. It's with sad and heavy hearts that the Lost Hills Sheriff Station announces the passing of Deputy Alicia Cajono. Alicia was a member of the station's juvenile intervention team, whose goal was to assist troubled school-aged youth who have begun to show signs of criminal misconduct or drug use. Alicia passed away peacefully surrounded by her family and friends on August 29, 2015, after a long and courageous battle with cancer. She will be deeply missed. So, do you have any guesses as to where these two local parks are? Well, tweet at us at Buzz Calabasas using the hashtag Where's Laura and let us know your thoughts. You could win a prize. Also, if you can't tweet, we'll just check us out at cityofcalabasas.com. Where's Laura? I'm Laura Nickerson. I'll be back next week with more of the buzz.